What's up guys, it's me Vlad, and today I found the craziest leak of the new Gorilla Tag update, and in this video I'm going to showcase it to you guys, and tell you guys everything about the new update that you have to know with the leak. So let's add into the Gorilla Tag and start uh, about the business, man, because I don't want to waste your guys' time, you don't want to waste my time, it's an equilibrium, man. Uh, that's uh, the term for it, and uh, if I actually go into the game, yes sir, yes sir, we gotta go into a private lobby so we don't disturb some people who are playing Grow Attack normally. It's raining outside, pretty beautiful, uh, and yeah, final, 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 final. So, essentially, as you guys may know, uh, Gorilla Tag is a game uh, with uh, different types of weather. Uh, there are, first of all, there are types of weather like rain, snow, and uh, I'm pretty sure there was just a normal type uh, with uh, sun out. Also, uh, this changes the overall skybox. And the time of the day also goes into the play because it changes the whole mood of the game. For example, during rain, we have clouds. Uh, when there is no rain, usually there's sun. And uh, throughout the day, it usually goes uh, with your time. Uh, and uh, it changes. And this new leak actually showcases a new feature. Which will allow you to switch the time of the day and the weather through the computer. And uh, actually, it's pretty believable. Considering uh, that we previously had a bunch of different leaks... Which were kind of fake, kind of fake, uh, not gonna lie, for example, there was a beach pen, which uh, actually a YouTuber fooled me with, and there was a couple of others, uh, which actually had spelling errors, so everyone really knew about uh, their credibility. But this leak actually showcases the computer screen uh, with the options, which actually look like options from uh, a uh, beta version inside of the game. First of all, what I want to showcase to you guys is, uh, if you guys didn't know, there are 24 developers working on the game currently. As you guys can see, seven in a row. One, two, three, four. So we have three full pages, three times seven, 21, 22, 23, 24. Yeah, 24 developers working on the game. So obviously they're making different things. And don't expect uh, like the new update uh, that, uh, we really won't get anything because because there are so many people working on the game one person can be working on the cosmetics another person can be working on this feature the other like five people are working on the new map the another five people are fixing bugs and another five people may be working on the actual space map highly recommend watching that video but let's actually showcase the leak and big credits to PMA Pro for actually finding this leak. Go subscribe to him. He's the GOAT. Uh, but essentially what he showcased is uh, this. So let me get into the Quest browser real quick uh, to showcase this to you guys. So I am pretty sure I uploaded it into my messages so you can see. By the way, make sure to join my Discord. It's the first link down below in the description. Uh, 170,000 members here and thank you guys everyone for 170,000 members okay so yeah this is the leak so as you guys can see uh, this leak pretty much says <laughs> update time settings uh, locally only so I'm pretty sure the time of the day will be local uh, with this mode and there are two modes option one for the normal mode and option two for the static mode normal mode is probably having the time of the day just uh, go passed by like normally and static may be that you will be actually fixed at one point of time uh, next you can see that uh, you can change the time from 1 to 10 uh, to actually select different times of the day and that seems pretty fair although there are 24 hours in the day there's only uh, I believe couple of uh, intermissions uh, between each uh, skybox change and as you guys can see current mode is normal time of the day is night uh, although you cannot really see this uh, mode 
on the left side. Maybe we're going to get some extra room for it. I don't know. Who knows? Or, or, uh, I've been considering this. If you guys actually don't know, uh, this uh, screen can be changed uh, with Unity Explorer. And that's how many people have faked the leaks of this board. For example, I'm pretty sure I've had it somewhere over here. Uh, yeah, that's how they faked this because you can change it with Unity Explorer. That's how they faked uh, this sign over here. Uh, and uh, a lot of stuff was faked uh, using just Unity Explorer. So I think maybe this may be fake. Uh, don't quote me on this. Uh, again, the credits go to uh, PMA Pro. Uh, go subscribe to him. But, uh, you know, I'm just stating what I think because Unity Explorer can pretty much change any text if you know the place of uh, the actual text being there. So. You know, think about this yourself. Personally, I believe that this may be real due to the sheer amount of uh, actual <laughs> information in here. Uh, usually, leaks are pretty dumb. Like, uh, as you guys can see, their previous leak I have shown over here, I believe. Yeah, it had a grammatical <laughs> error <laughs> when it said, uh, beware. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> uh, you can clearly see this yourself, but... You know, it's your choice, guys, uh, to deliver the latest information to you guys. If you want more leaks and stay up to date with the latest Grow Tag news, make sure to click on that subscription button. We're on our road to 40k, and only you can help me reach that goal. And it was me, Vlad. Uh, probably the last things I want to say which are confirmed is that the new update might be actually mining. <coughs> Although... Uh, I don't really think that it's going to be mining. I think it's going to be actual cave going under and into a beach map. And uh, you may ask me, why do you think it's going to be a beach map, man? Uh, there are little cave signs over here. Because if you guys don't know, there are bodies of water inside of caves. Literally, there are whole seas. That's how most of the water we drink, um, we get from the actual caves, man. Because it's filtered there, man. Uh, and as you guys can see, there's sand over here. And guess what? There's uh, sand in caves too. <laughs> and uh, you know what? Uh, this update is coming out during the summer update. And guess what, man? Again, again. The beach, the beach, man. The beach is the place where people go on the vacation. And people go on the vacation during summer. So it all ties in because the cosmetics are leaving the store. Uh, we get new cosmetics summer slash beach cosmetics. Uh, I mean, we had some mining cosmetics. I don't think uh, any more will be added. This is just for the teaser that uh, this is uh, breaking. And uh, pretty much we're going to mine our way through there. And uh, we have another teaser, which was in the canyons. If you guys remember, it actually had uh, a palm tree emoji there, as well as the teaser for swinging mechanic, which I predicted. Uh, and, uh, you know, all of this actually leads us to the conclusion that we're going to have a beach map behind us, man. It's probably going to be interconnected with the caves because there are the same signs over there. So maybe there will be, there will be some mining work there. So we're going to get uh, the mines flooded and maybe it will lead into the beach map over there and we can come out of here or to the opposite. So this is just my thoughts about this. Also, if you guys don't remember, we got uh, an official teaser posted by Girl Attacks Twitter with a palm tree emoji. Many people forgot that, but uh, that's still a thing. Uh, and guess what? A palm tree emoji means a beach. <laughs> uh, and uh, it was even on the wall in canyons, like I said. So my theory is that we're actually getting a beach map. And quote me on this, I don't really care we're getting a beach map in the new map. I don't really care, man. Because I full heartedly believe that we're getting a beach map. And I'm going to be disappointed if we're going to get just an interconnection between caves and the secret tunnel. So, uh, let me your or oh, let me know your thoughts about this in the comments, man. Uh, ain't no way, man. Uh, yeah. So this is pretty much it.
the weather is raining it's kind of sad i'm gonna be honest but we gotta end this video also to join my discord my discord is the first thing down below in the description you have seen it previously uh, but if you haven't, we have a ton of Quest 2 game sales there. I saved myself 10 bucks on Bone Lab uh, just by using one Quest referral. And there are a ton of Quest referrals for different games, so you can save a ton of money. Uh, as I said, we have 170,000 members in our Discord who are already saving. Actually, 171,000, as you guys can see over here. Uh, but a ton of people are saving money on this. Uh, I myself actually saved. 10 bucks on Bone Lab, and I have put them into Grow Attack and bought some Shiny Rocks with that money. So you can save a ton of money, you can use that money whatever way you want. I just made a place for you guys to save your own, you know, money or whatnot. But uh, yeah, there are a ton of links. For example, this was posted at 2 p.m. Currently, it's like 7 p.m., I'm pretty sure. And this is how many links were posted since. And, um, I mean, you can search for the games that you want to buy. Uh, you can ask people for the games. For example, there's even Grill Attack PC VR version. If you want to get mods, highly recommend this version. Because it gives you 25% off of the Oculus version of the game. Uh, and you can install mods there. Play with your friends. Play with anyone else. Because it's cross-platform. So, yeah. That's pretty much it. Thank you for watching the video, guys. Have a great rest of your Sunday, Saturday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Thursday, Friday, whenever you're watching this, man. Uh, and see you next one. Bye-bye. I'm out. Make sure to click on the subscription button or watch another one of these fire videos, which you can see on the screen. Bye-bye. I'm out.